Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I've got a cool kit here that I think his name was Sam down at Southlands gave me and I've been waiting to open this thing. You're going to open it, Matthew? You're going to take the plastic off? Yes, I am. The best I can tell, this kit is from 1989. I, I could be wrong, but Scalemates is not real specific on this exact kit, except um, there was one. The only difference, the kit looks like... Wow, that motorcycle. You hear that motorcycle? Wow. It's the, uh, this one's the Select Collection MRC, and uh, the, the box that it shows from 89 just doesn't have that. So I'm pretty sure it's the same, it's, it's the same kit. I just don't know the year. But anyway, I'm going to open it up and check it out. Ever since he gave it to me, I've been wanting to open it. I'm getting over the uh, fear of opening models. I'm like, okay, let, whatever. So let's do it. Oh, no, Matthew, don't do it. Okay, let's do it. I want to thank Sam. I'm just going to, again, I'm just going to say his name, Sam. I, I, I can't find the comment, and I, I met so many people that day. I forgot which name was which, but I'm pretty sure his name's Sam. Anyway, Sam or not. You know who you know who you are, and I know who you are. We just don't remember your name exactly. All right, here we go. Oh man, and it looks so much nicer with the plastic off. That is an F40 Ferrari F40 is one of the most amazing cars that Ferrari ever produced, in my humble opinion. Um, one of Enzo is, as far as I know, one of Enzo Ferrari's last contribute uh, contributions to the supercar world before he passed away. I think that's how it went. But anyway, this cool, cool Fujimi, MRC Fujimi F40. And here we go. Let's open her up. Oh, look at the red plastic here. Okay. Oh, it's all in one big bag. And then it's in smaller bags. Here's the instructions. I don't like, I don't do... Okay, is it a curbside? I think it has an engine. It does, sort of. I don't know. We'll look. Okay. I don't. I don't really get into like instruction sheets. I'm like, okay, that's the instruction. I don't even like looking at them if I don't have. To. I don't have to. Like I said, I wanted to open this thing up because it's really cool. I'm gonna check the parts out, and see if it is in fact. A detailed engine and I see the wheels they look nice wheels and tires oh and it's got some kind of mesh that goes with it let's see what that is oh, it's got staples I didn't realize that it's cool I've had a uh, Fujimi car before that I built and it had the tires already mounted on the wheels like this very rubbery um, tires as well very realistic looking nice 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 tread pattern I mean really nice so that's really cool they're they're stuck on but they're not all the way because the, the wheels are still on the tree and there's some little parts I don't want to lose here better put those back in the box and now is the what the heck is this? It's some wire mesh. Maybe this okay, this is probably you cut this out. You see this? Let's see if I get the focus. It's a wire. Wire mesh. I mean it's not like cloth, this is wire. And then you have a template here. And I bet that's what that's for. To cut out those parts. We will, we will investigate. Here are the um, 1988. Okay, I was wrong. No, I wasn't. I said 89, didn't I? So that's right close. I bet those aren't any good, but I, I bet I could still get the the, uh, the ones that that are definitely needed, like the hood or, or hood emblems and things like that, because the uh, I did a Porsche Fujimi Porsche, and the uh, decals did not fare so well. Let's open this body. 
and it's not all squashed or squished so uh, the box is in perfect shape that is really nice I'm looking for like party lines and stuff I'm, what I do notice is this and it, it would be a, 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 a wet sanding or something um, let's see if I can get it to show if in the in the plastic there we go you see them it's almost like it's uh, got sanding scratches in it or something you can't really feel them even in on the roof you see them huh that's peculiar on the yeah like I don't know if it was something with their batch of plastic the rear wing or I'm sorry rear spoiler that's not a wing Matthew it's a spoiler but yeah anyway cool 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 all that stuff probably just a uh, just coat of primer would would take care of the majority of it um, the rear spoiler is a little bowed where it should be straight across so that would be probably some hot water get that right back into shape but I don't there's not even any parting lines on this thing this thing is really nice too cool it says f40 right there in it and that's not raised that is actually in the plastic down deep into the plastic at the windshield I keep forgetting the staple when I pick up the knife Always shake your bags out. I have thrown parts in the trash before. There's the in interior tub right there with the gated shifter. That's pretty cool. Let's see if I can get it to zoom in on the gated. See the little shifter? Gated style. That would be cool to drive one that you had to, you know, it had to fit it in the gates. There's the race car like dash. The um, was this thing turbocharged? It looks like intercoolers for the intake. I don't know if it is or not. Okay, so it's not a very detailed engine. Okay, that we see the engine here. Um, not a super detailed engine, but an engine nevertheless. Here's the rear of the car. Isn't it? No, it's not the rear of the car. What the heck is this? Don't know. Where does that go? Maybe it goes... That's why you got directions, Matthew. Yeah, you're right. And does it have a roll bar? Or is that just like, that's probably a, a body panel support. And I think those are door panels, if I'm not mistaken. I did it again, picked up the knife. This thing is in pristine shape. I mean, not a part is off the tree. Not a part. There's your awesome looking race car chassis with the lower suspension arms on it. Not a bit of flash on this either. I mean, this thing is like, oh, when I said that, look at this. Okay, there is a bit of flash, just a teeny bit. Okay, I see a few little spots. But other than that, this thing is like really nice. Oh, man, those seats are so cool. Straight up racing seats. It's like the, maybe the exhaust. Not 100% about that, but let's look kind of like the exhaust. Some little bitty part that I don't know. There's the top portion of the dash right there. The uh, instrument panel. Um, uh, gear shifter, I believe. Right there in that little square. The blinker. And uh, windshield wipers. And Ferrari steering wheel. It's really cool. Steering components. Disc brakes. Um, there's another cooler of some type two of them rear view mirrors emergency brake for emergencies front and rear suspension nice very nice and then the glass let's see what the glass looks like looks like glass and this thing is this is nice to get a kit that is completely everything is just like it left the factory here's your windshield and your windows on the side there's your rear win window that uh, you can see the engine it would be a vented I suppose window 
Um, not sure what that little guy is. Maybe maybe a rear window of some sort, and maybe headlight covers right there. And then your other. Let's see, there's some lights, light light covers. I don't know. Don't know. We'd have to get into it, but yeah, cool, very cool. So thank you so much. I'll put these back in bags. I don't want to get them the windshield scratched or anything. Thank you so much to my friend Sam. I'll probably get a, a message. Matthew, my name's not Sam. It's Randy or something like that, but I'm pretty sure it's Sam. All right, guys, thank you for watching this quick video. Just I just wanted to open this kit, and I thought, well, if I'm going to open it, I might as well share it with you guys. Have you ever built this kit? It looks phenomenal as far as a simple kit, but yet um, the, the, the uh, oh, yeah, the... Uh, ability to do something nice with this because this is jam up um just a jam up body a little wet sanding a little straightening of the uh rear spoiler as you see it right there nice and straight this one's got just a little bit of bow so straighten that up oh man this would be so nice i might just build this all right guys thanks for watching if you hadn't subscribed please do so please do well, please do, but do so um, if you don't mind. Subscribe if you hadn't already. Thanks to everyone that has subscribed to my channel. You've grown me far beyond my belief, um, and it is it is wonderful. So thank you so much for all of your, you guys' support in whatever uh, mode it may be in. Um, don't forget to go, speaking of support, go support a small business, hobbynutmodels.com, linked in the description of this video. Go check out Mark's inventory on kits, older kits, hard to find kits, new kits, paints, glues, all the things you need to build a quality model. You can find them at hobbynutmodels.com, found in the, the description box of this video, as well as the Facebook group, the Spring Store, where you can buy a great model car videos, coffee mug t-shirt to wear or long sleeve or a hoodie if it's cold and other things like that and uh, the patreon page go check that out um thank you to all my patreon members and uh, hey guys we're done with this video what a cool car see you guys on the next one